Um, first we have Paola. Hi, I am Paola. I am a student at Harvard University. My dad's in the military and I'm a friend. And here's my question. I'm confused for who to vote for. Why should I vote for you? What will you do about the war? I have a master plan to bring all soldiers back in, in 2014 or earlier. Um, since we are in Afghanistan right now, um, I want to make sure that we train the troops and leave. We need to put our foot down and leave. Um, <laughs> please repeat your question. Why should we put you while we do the war? I also want to uh, train our troops again to make sure that their methods are all modern. Um, any other questions? No? Okay. Um, next on my list, I have Nina. And I work at the Art Institute in New York. And my question is, is because since there's so many people in our town, the economy is raising the health care prices, so many people in my city can't afford it. Can you fix that? Yes. You see, I want to start at the root of the problem by fixing the economy the best of my ability. And then I will bridge it out into health care using the branches. Any other questions? Um, okay. um, next, we have Kate Hello, I am a uh, doctor at Dalso, uh, at the Dalso Hospital in England. Uh, so, if I get really sick and I can't afford healthcare, um, are you going to lower or just keep waiting, raising the insurance? Before I answer that question, I would like to ask you one question. Are you considering immigrating to America since you now live in um, Yes. Okay. Well, thank you for coming this very long, long distance. Um, and I want to, using the internet, uh, branch out healthcare that in the country, you can um, go onto the internet and print out the code for your um, sickness or whatever. And um, what's it called? Uh, sorry, nerves are acting up. Um, and so you don't have to be on a trip and have to go and Google how to do it because you cannot afford healthcare. Do you have any other questions? Okay, thank you. Okay, um, sorry, my cellular phone was ringing. Elena? Elena, how would you change physical education in local schools? Um, the physical education in local schools? Well, I want to make sure physical education, or as PE is now said, um, is very uh, fun for the children, and I make sure that they are still learning how to uh, be fit, but they also are having fun and they get to have chances to run around, which is very rare. Um, let me tell you what the opposing candidates would do. Here, you may sit. <laughs> um, those are candidates for the war. He, or, yes, he wants to let the troops come back when they come back. He wants to let them sit there, let them wait until they either are this close to them or this close to them. I want to bring them back by 2014. Um, Mina, your question was um, uh, the education and economy. My opponent, er, <laughs> the other candidate um, did say in a recent speech that for the economy and healthcare, he said they had nothing to do with each other and he would not make them into a bridge. He would make sure if he did anything, they would be separate. So that would have doubled the time of the problem being fixed. Um, 
Um, Caitlin, I am so glad that you are coming to America and voting. Uh, what is your age? I am um, you 20. Okay. Um, so, I would like to compare my other candidate. Um, he does not welcome Im immigrants to the country now. So, if you were to vote for him and he was to win, you wouldn't be able to immigrate into this country. But I think that you should be able to come into the country as long as you qualify. And you qualify to vote. Do you, do you have a family? Yes, I have a little brother and a little sister. They should be able to come too. I want everyone to, to, uh, to be able to come to America. I know that is a problem right now, but I do not want to let that random guy on the street come in. I would like him to be well qualified and so we don't have disease, uh, foreign disease coming into our country. And Elena. Oh, I already told you what my opposing candidate did. Okay. Um, are there any other questions? No. Um, vote for me. Um, and I gave you the reasons that you should vote for me. If there's any questions at home, please uh, send any letters to the PO Box 9723 in Washington, D.C. Thank you.